it just shows that um, you know he's excited. He loves the game, you know, um, and we're happy for him. Happy to have him. Um, happy to have his you know excitement on the team and just to keep driving. So. He's a quarterback. Um, he demands it. You know, he runs the offense. He tells us, you know, the receivers, O linemen, what to do, and we go out there and execute it. Tim Kelly was kind of joking about it. It's crazy. Oh yeah, yeah. Will, you know, sometimes it's a little freaky, <laughs> but you know, you just got to understand that that's Will, and just move on from. It. When your when your quarterback is that competitive, I mean, how does it kind of filter through the offense in those late game situations? Um, you know, if it showed Monday. Um, you know, you you want to have somebody like that on the team, and especially the quarterback that can go out there with that enthusiasm, and you know, it, it just lingers down throughout everyone, and we just go out there and play. Do you, do you have any critique of how Derek went up and happened to be at ball? No, he did it perfect. That's money. <laughs> Yeah, I think that, you know, having consistency is big and also just finding the schemes that really, really fit us and, and, and work against our opponent, I think, has been big, too. And then just going out and executing, I think that's not a big thing. And then just committing to that run game and executing the run game. How do you think you've grown over the course of your rookie season? Yeah, I think I've definitely made some improvements and obviously, you know, a lot to work on and, and get better at, you know, the ups and downs. Um, but, you know, continuing to just go out there every day and try to make little improvements. I think I, looking back to when I started, I think I've made those, you know, little improvements over time. How, how do you guys feel when you get through a game like last night? We will had a lot, a lot of time to throw most of the night. Uh, just as a group of five, of giving them, giving them that time to throw and make some big plays? Yeah, I mean, obviously that's a, a point of pride for us when you execute, you know, three two-minute drills. Um, that's really as tough as it gets for an O-line in terms of projection. Um, so that was huge for sure. Um, you know, I look back at some plays I went back and you look at what you can fix and, and that, you know, you just kind of keep going with that. But I think there's definitely confidence there in terms of how we protect, protect it, especially in those critical moments.